Good morning, everybody. Pappy's vlog here. It is Thursday. It is September 28th. I'm pretty sure it's the 28th. What's happening, everybody? What's happening, all my friends out there? What's happening, all, all you guys that went to your locals last night? What's happening? Today's a sad day. You have to died last night. 91 years old. An icon. I had the privilege of delivering his magazines for all over 30 some odd years. And used to look forward to looking for the little bunny symbol on the front page every month. Um, yes, I delivered hundreds of copies, hundreds of copies throughout my route from New Bedford, Cape Cod area. I worked for a new uh, newspaper magazine distributor for over 30 years, um, delivered numerous magazines, you name it, crosswords, um, uh, paperback books, hardcover books, um, Harlequin romance, um, a Women's Day Family Circle, a Cosmopolitan, um, Vanity Fair, Everything, Stuff Magazine, um, everything, uh, hundreds and hundreds of copies, hundreds and hundreds of daily newspapers, Boston Globe, New York Times, USA Today, Daily News, Daily Post, Providence Journal, Worcester Telegram, Montreal Star, um, Springfield Union, everything. Worcester Telegram, Boston Herald, um, yeah, so, so I knew firsthand of the play, Playboy and Playgirl, uh, for the women, um, in later years, they got more graphic, it was honcho, blue balls, <laughs> all that, um, High Society, Hustler was Larry Flint, um, yeah, there's, you name it, Wee Magazine, and everything, so the legend is gone, yeah, so, the Raj, what's the Raj are gonna do now, <laughs> oh god, that was his boy, the legend. Oh, God. We know that. We all know that. You have has been sick for years and hasn't left the mansion. Um, and it's Sunday. They just did a thing. Uh, Sunday. The sun, sun runs the business now. Um, Cooper, I think. Cooper Hefner. Uh, I think it's Cooper. Young kid, he's 28 years old, 29. Real intelligent. You know, it's a billion dollar business. The man was brilliant. Started the, uh, started, uh, I think he had $8,000 in his pocket in 1953. He started the first edition. Marilyn Monroe. And I had that copy. I came across that copy. Um, years ago, I cleaned out. This guy had died. He was living in the city here, but previously he worked at a New York bookstore back in the 40s and 50s. And he brought all that stuff and had it in his attic. So when he died, it's, um, somehow his sister knew my brother and asked if they could clean out uh, the attic and stuff and we could have all the contents. And it was 
There was uh, two or three copies of the Playboy for uh, 1953. We, at the time, this was like 25 years ago, we ended up selling them for, at the time, it was like eight, 800 bucks each. They're probably well worth more than that now, well worth more. The original copies. Yeah, stupid. But, yeah, they say it's going to cool off over here today. It's going to be uh, relatively uh, seasonal. So we're going to get rid of this hot humidity. It's going to be pretty nice. Um, Raj is going to go live tonight, Thursday. Be a little moment before he goes to Vegas. Uh... I was watching Rock and Roller last night because I, I, um, the Raja said he was gonna, he's gonna see him in Vegas. So I guess the Rock and Roller is gonna go there. So I, so I, I, I says, hey, you're gonna see the Raj? And he said the Raj should play different games. The Rock and Roller said it. <laughs> I think Raj knows what he's playing. Raj has been around a long time. Raj knows what he's playing. Rock and roll is small potatoes. I guess in the UK they think they're big potatoes because they play online stuff. You know. But they don't forget we had online too at one time. It's just that was cutting into the uh, all these casinos' profits. And they weren't building casinos as, as fast when it was online gambling. So the lobbyists and everybody had a lot of stuff to do with that. You know. So, yeah, I can't wait till the Raj goes on tonight. See the Raj. Um, something to look forward to. My Red Sox won last night, so still maintain a three-game lead with four games to go in American League East. Um, you got three or four players, starters, that haven't haven't played because of uh, they got hurt. Um, really, would you really... I mean, I wish they would have wrapped things up by now. Do you really want to show your cards to uh, the Houston Astros? Which the, the, a team that they could possibly play in the first round. Their starting pitching has been sporadic. They're, like I said, their hitting has been anemic against subpar pitching. Um, I don't know. Is it a privilege just to make the playoffs? I don't know. To the owners, when you spend that um, uh, that amount of money, you know we had a wasted we had a wasted pick. They picked two years ago with this Pablo Sandoval, spent millions of dollars on him. He goes back to San Francisco and he gets one home run, and they think he uh, he's the best thing since sliced bread. Uh, I don't know. The Yankees have been playing crazy baseball too. You know, they could be a uh, Juggernaut for somebody in the uh, playoffs. Um, Patriots play Carolina this week. Uh, I got a few players back. Let's see what happens. Seems like Carolina and all these teams they they before they play the Patriots they just about score points. They play the Patriots they score points. I don't know. We'll see what happens. I like to see him go three games up, you know. I don't see uh, anybody even competing against them in the division again, you know. Um, I'm glad every almost everybody lost, though. I'm glad Denver lost. I'm glad uh, um, Oakland lost. I'm glad uh, uh, the only ones I... Uh, we, and they're going to lose. Is KC's going to lose. Then I, I mean, they're a good team. They just caught the Patriots off guard there. Like I said, first game, they didn't play together. Um, in preseason. I wish they wouldn't have started Edelman that last game, really. It would have been so much better. My coffee, excuse me. It's 6.15. On the East Coast, so it's only 4:15 in Colorado, and 3:15 uh, in uh, Los Angeles right now. But I'm up early. I'm up at 4:30 every morning. 
Um, usually in bed. Um, I'm usually in bed at uh, 7, 7.30. Uh, laying down at least, you know, watching a rise. Uh, I like to watch... Uh, I like to watch the online gambling from the UK. I like to watch a few of the gambling channels. Uh, uh, I don't watch Rude. I don't watch uh, other ones. I like um, NG Slots. I like uh, Dixie Chicks. All right, and Holly and all that. You know. Uh, Yeah, that's the pe president did his tax speech up in Indiana last night. Eh, I don't know. I don't know. It's out of my league. I'm just a porpoise ass. You know? All right. I just wanted to go on and do my daily blog. Bob goes home today. So... Be back Saturday. All right, guys. I won't keep you guys. Uh, my all my 49 subscribers. Which I had one view yesterday. That's it. Um. Yeah. I wish you guys nothing but the best. If you go to your locals, don't stop the turkey. Um. I wish Raj all the best tonight at Blackhawk. Okay. Get a good start. Uh, bring in some revenue from there. Uh, and I'm um, looking forward to seeing you tonight and also uh, in Vegas uh, when you play. Um, good luck, Brian T. Um, good luck, all the people that associate with the big jackpot that are going there. I mean, you have luck also. That's it, guys. Okay, you guys. Have, have a good day. God bless. Okay, Pappy's vlog. And remember, don't stuff the turkey. Bye, everybody.